Okay, so I've been thinking about making a YouTube channel for a while. I even tried it ages ago, but I made two videos then gave up. Uh, I'm in this feedback loop where I don't want to make content for nobody, but nobody's going to be here if there's no content. So I may as well just make some content and then see if people turn up, but to do that I need to keep making content, so I'm going to try and stick to it this time. Uh, I spend a lot of my time watching Let's Plays, I follow a bunch of channels, I'm not going to name any in particular, but a lot of them have really bad commentary. No offence, I'm going to be really bad as well, but it gives me hope that my bad commentary can easily attract a similar audience to other YouTubers who have equally bad commentary. Like, we can all be bad together and succeed. Um, it also means I can improve on aspects that other Let's Players do really badly, like... I'll go over it in a bit, but my channel's gonna have no whistling, no singing, none of that crap. Not that I'm not gonna have fun, but I'm not gonna have fun like that, because that just rapes people's audio if they're wearing headphones, that kind of thing. Um, I'm doing this mainly to help out with my anxiety. I feel pretty anxious reading my little notes that I've got here to a webcam, which is weird and wrong. But hopefully it improves my self-confidence, all that kind of stuff. Um, give me a purpose as well, because I live in a rural area of a rural area in Lincolnshire, which is a rural area in England. Not if you didn't know that already, but there's basically nothing out here at all. I have a car, but there's nowhere to go in it. There's nobody to meet, nobody to see. My friends live 20 miles away, they all have either jobs or they've gone to university or whatever, and I've kind of been left behind, but whatever. I seem to enjoy myself on my own playing games and stuff, but that's not too healthy, so I'm going to try and involve random internet strangers that can watch me online, and that's going to be great. <laughs> um, so, the upsides of my channel, I have a good quality microphone, if you can't already hear that, I have good headphones, good computer, I have good internet, so I can upload it like 720p, maybe better, probably not better, that's a pain in the ass to record. Uh, I have a really good PC, like ridiculously good, so any games I do play will be set to the max, I can record them at nearly the max, and then I can upload the stuff really easily. I'm not going to be having any adverts, I'm not going to be trying to make money off this YouTube channel yet, <laughs> uh, but <laughs> that got you guys, it's all the long con. Uh, but I'm not going to be trying to shove adverts down your face. If anything, I'll be suggesting download Adblock, which you can look up. It's an extension for your internet browser that can block all adverts. It's great. And you have never have to look at crap ever again. I'm not going to be doing weird annotation spams that are like, click my next video at the start, end, or in the middle, or any of that. There's going to be no intros, no outros. There's going to be no merchandise shoved down your throat. I'm just going to play games, and you're going to watch me play games. You hear that? Uh, I'm not going to be overreacting, I'm not going to be weird, I'm not going to be putting on some sort of act or anything, I'm just going to play games, I'm going to try and commentate, I'm going to try and explain my choices in commentary, and I'm going to try and enjoy the story with people hopefully also enjoying it alongside me, because I know, at least I do, watch YouTube to just have a voice there that you can listen to that makes you feel a little less lonely. And if I can do that for a couple of people, that's great, because I feel like I've helped out. Um, I'm going to be putting all the stuff that I make onto YouTube first, obviously, but then I'm going to copy that link across to a Reddit subreddit, and it'd be better if anybody did want to comment or anything and do it there, because the voting algorithm puts stuff at the top, so it's not going to be a problem for at least a long time. But when you start getting, say, 100 YouTube comments, the top, like, 20 all end up in a little pile, and you can't really discern which one people want you to read the most, you can't discern the replies to the comments, you can't really have like a banter go on, because it's all just one wall of text that people have posted and all the replies are hidden. But on Reddit, the top posts that people like the most get filtered to the top, and you can see them the easiest, you can see the replies to them, and the replies get filtered to the top depending on what people like the most. So if I ever had a mediocrely sized YouTube community, the like, watching my videos, if people commented there, it'd be so much easier to figure out what people wanted me to read, what they wanted to suggest me to play, because if, like, five different people all suggest five things, you can upvote the one you like, and then it puts it to the top, but, yeah, whatever. 
We'll get that to when we come to. If you just want to comment on YouTube, that's fine. I'll probably get round to it anyway. Got nothing better to do. Um, if you don't like me, my voice, the content, my freaky light that has this backdrop thing going on, like disco lights, if you don't like anything about it, just you don't have to watch it. Nobody's forcing you to watch it. No, I'm showing it down your throat. Apart from Raven, he has to watch it. He's my friend. He's my only friend. <laughs> But yeah, I'm I'm not going to be bad at the games I'm playing, so it's not going to be cringeworthy or you're not going to have to force yourself to watch my stuff. Uh, in Hearthstone, I consistently rank 5, which is top 2% in the world. Magic the Gathering, I constantly get like 3-1 or 4-0 at Friday nights, but I've never played any greater than that. And in Dota, I'm 3200 MMR, which is like over a thousand above average. It's not me bragging, it's just evidence that I'm good at strategic levels of games and you can watch me to maybe learn how to play different things or get better at a certain thing or at the very least see a different perspective on the games that you have already played or are going to play. You could use them as a judgement for something you might want to play in the future. So yeah, I'm going to try and upload stuff on a regular basis but I'm not going to set myself to a schedule because I don't want to make this feel like a chore or a job or anything. I just want to have fun, 